Hi, I'm Miranda Adams. And I'm Charmian Kay. We both play violin in the APO, and since we are family, we are also in lockdown together here in West Auckland. These five short duos we will play are by two Kiwi friends of ours, Jonathan Besser and Chris Prosser, who come from folk and klezmer backgrounds, where improvising is a part of the music. First up, Lee's Tango. by Chris Prosser, starting with Dawn Chorus.
Hi everyone, welcome to the Auckland Philharmonia Orchestra's Coffee Break series. My name is Eric Rennick and welcome to my living room. Have a look around, make yourself at home. Um, yeah, these are strange, strange times. Um, very strange for artists. Um, we really rely on community and bringing people together to share in um, a common experience. Um, so this is a really odd time for us. We're all dealing with it in many different ways. Um, I've been fortunate enough to spend a lot of time with the family and we were going on walks, sometimes three and four walks a day. <laughs> and I obviously picked up the marimba um, just before lockdown, went in and took it apart and brought it to the lounge. Because um, it's a part of me, it's something that I like to do on a daily basis. It's something that um, makes me feel good. So I'm really glad to have gotten this into the, to the lounge. And also grateful for this opportunity to um, give something to you. I'm going to perform a piece by a composer named Andy Akiho, who's a great composer out of the States. I really love his stuff. I've played a couple of his things now. And um, this piece is called Karakuranai, um, which is Japanese, and I, my Japanese is nil. I know none of it. So um, I apologize if that is highly incorrect pronunciation. But it's part of Andy's synesthesia suite. And this color in Japanese means foreign crimson. Um, so I had that in mind when I was learning this. Um, for me, it's a beautiful puzzle as well. It's based on a pattern of 31 notes, which as you can imagine, like it's a prime number, it's odd, it doesn't really fit into anything well, but Andy's found a way to make it fit beautifully into what we've done here. The other thing I've done with it is that I've created a digital track using synthesizers, recording me playing snare drum and shakers and um, just messing with that kind of stuff. That's been a lot of fun for me to play with while I've had the time. And um, also to replicate that idea of community, um, just playing this by myself was, was gratifying for a small time, but um, ultimately you want that feeling of playing with other people. So put this out into the world and not without saying a huge thank you to all of our subscribers who have generously donated their ticket prices. Um, I know we're canceling events left and right and um, that's a real bummer. Um, especially if you're planning on going. Um, but to donate the ticket price is really generous, it's really great, and it's one of those things that's gonna help us um, come out of this, this pandemic and be able to do events again in the future. So a huge thanks to that. Um, great, I just have to start the little software thing and we'll get going. 